Class will soon be back in session at a vacant school building in North Buffalo. Rachel Kingston has details on the future of the former Holy Angels Academy. Neighbors had their first chance to ask questions of the people who are taking over the former Holy Angels Academy on Thursday evening. Representatives from the McGuire Group and Charter School for Applied Technology listened to their concerns. And I also have concerns about the, the keeping of the grounds. Charter School for Applied Technology will move its middle school students in grades 6 through 8 into the North Buffalo facility in August. The building can accommodate 500 students and will likely be filled to capacity. Among the neighbors' concerns were traffic, busing, noise, and maintenance of the building and grounds. Safety, that's what we want, mainly the safety, and, uh, and uh, we just hope that the kids uh, are all well behaved. Frank Palladino said he came away from Thursday's discussion with a good feeling. And I think things will probably work out. They're willing to work with the, uh, with the residents, and that means a lot. Communication is huge. They have some issues. They're, nothing is an unfixable issue. So I feel very confident that we can all get on the same page very quickly. McGuire, which bought a 50% ownership stake in the property last December, is doing some sprucing up both inside and out. Shane Brown is confident another school is a good fit for both the building and the neighborhood. Holy Angels has been around for so long, and so many people are graduates, relatives of graduates. It, it would break my heart to do anything but educate students in this building. Rachel Kingston, News 4 at 10.